My name is Jeff Anderson. I am the founder of Jeff Anderson and Associates. We have been working with and advocating for survivors of sexual abuse by clergy for 38 years. I want to address today the removal of Father Flager from his post by the Archdiocese of Chicago. There is controversy around his removal, and I want to shed light and invite the community and all to understand and to know that this is a time for understanding, this is a time for mindful action, this is the time for further investigation. First, understanding. Having worked with survivors for decades, we understand, and people must understand that survivors of sexual abuse by clergy cannot report it, cannot share that shameful, painful secret with anybody and more often in time don't until decades later. This allegation leading to the temporary removal of Father Flager, Flager ha is alleged to have happened 40 years ago. People do not want to believe that it's real because of the passage of time. Survivors of sexual abuse suffer in secrecy, silence, and shame, and cannot report it, cannot even recognize it as abuse, and live in fear, self-blame, shame, and guilt. And it takes decades more often than not to share that secret. An understanding of that dynamic is required, not just by us, but by the community at this time. Second, Investigation is required, but protection of kids must come before there can be anything else. And so that the action taken by the Archdiocese of Chicago, we stand in support of. And the action taken by them in temporarily removing him pending investigation and making that known to the public is the appropriate thing. And finally, getting to the bottom of it through investigation and understanding um, and not rushing to judgment, but making sure that kids are protected first uh, is the appropriate way. So we stand in support of any survivor who finds the courage to make the report. We stand in support of the Archdiocese of Chicago in following their, pro, their, their protocol in removing him temporarily. We stand in support of getting to the bottom of it and doing an investigation so the truth can be known. We also stand uh, in support of, and particularly, in support of this survivor that had the courage to make a report to the archdiocese that caused the archdiocese to temporarily remove Father Flager, do an investigation, and make this known. It takes courage, and it's time for understanding, it's time for investigation, it's time for truth, and it's time for the protection of the kids in putting their safety first. And the archdiocese having removed him, uh, this report having been treated with the, the gravity it deserves, and uh, understanding of it uh, by the community and the archdiocese is really important.